Okay, so earlier this week, um, this last Wednesday actually, I uh, got this email from my friend Ian, and it was just a little link to a guy on Fox News. It was a little video blurb about this guy named Woodrow Lanfair, who had just done exactly what me and Ryan were planning on doing. Pretty much he had um, traveled to all 48 states on a motorcycle, um, sold pretty much everything he had um, before, he, before he left on his trip, um, just took off, went to all 40, 48 states, got jobs along the way to pay for his trip, um, and did this whole thing, and he ended up like writing books about it and stuff like that. And it was a really cool little video clip. Um, if you want to check it out, I'll post a link in the blog too. There should be a link um, right with this video. But um, So I watched it and I was actually kind of upset at first. I was kind of like, dang it, man. Like This guy totally did exactly what I wanted to do. And it seems like, oh, my idea is like, not very original anymore. And then I started to think about it a little bit more. And I realized, you know, riding a motorcycle across the country isn't that original. Anyway, so um, it wasn't that upsetting. So what I did is... Uh, I went to the guy's website, it's woodrowlandfair.com, and I was just looking at things and I found his email address and I thought I'd send him an email. And this was on Friday, the 28th of uh, September, and so I sent him this letter and basically I tell him, you know, hey, uh, I'm just really interested in, in getting, to, getting to know you and asking you some questions and uh, I was just wondering if I can send you some questions and I also said, you know, if you're ever in Long Beach, um, you know, traveling through Long Beach, you know, hey, you can stay at my house, I got a ton of questions for you because I'm planning on doing the same thing. So uh, I sent him, sent him this email. 45 minutes later, he, he writes back. I'm like, whoa, there's this guy I just saw on the news, and he's writing back to me like 45 minutes later. And he's like, hey, you know, um, I'm actually in town, he said. He's actually in L.A. And so I talked to him. Turns out he's going to be in L.A. until uh, today, Sunday. And so I was like, hey, you know what? I'll, uh, I was like, hey, can I, can I take you out to coffee or something and just come out and meet you? And he's like, sure. So I meet up with him la last night, Saturday night, at like 8.30 at night. And... Uh, we just talked for like two and a half hours. Um, it was a really cool time, really good conversation. Um, Woodrow's just a, a really cool guy, and I really respect what he did on his trip. And just the experiences that he had um, are, are just amazing. And so, uh, just it was awesome experience for me. T total learning experience, really encouraging. Um, just that Woodrow was totally believed in us uh, about this idea. He was just like so excited for us to do this trip. Like it was. I, I don't know how to explain it, but it was just so cool to see someone who just accomplished something so huge to be so excited for, for us uh, and our voyage that we plan on taking. And so um, that was really encouraging. Um, asked him a ton of questions and just ended up uh, driving home just really excited about this trip. Really um, really feeling like, you know what, this is where where I'm supposed to be. This is what I'm supposed to be doing is pursuing this. and. Um, really encouraged. I, I was just so shocked that he happened to be in LA while I sent him the email and stuff like that. So um, it was great. Um, and uh, just I would encourage you guys to just check out his site, uh, maybe buy his shirt or something, and um, just support the guy. Uh, seems like a really neat guy. Um, and I could totally see him just doing some really successful things in life. And so, Woodrow, I just want to say thanks, man. That was awesome experience for me. Um, learned, a, learned a bunch. And um, and it makes me want to leave tomorrow, but uh, anyway, I just totally respect you for what you did, and uh, thank you.